uh, with this modern facility of stone and mortar and steel uh, and highly sophisticated technology, uh, yet very environmentally friendly, uh, it's here that we're dedicating ourselves to preserve and promote the health of our community and our neighbors. And it's the fruition of a lot of dreams and aspirations that many have had for many, many years and a lot of hard work. And at this point in time, there are a number of people I think we do want to, to recognize. You know, if you look in the, in the fabric of our community, if you go to small communities throughout Nebraska, things that they look on as a source of pride and actually also a source of attracting businesses has been their health care. And when they've had a health care facility and providers, uh, that's been a source of enormous comfort, uh, people dedicated to keep them healthy. And yet in Bellevue, we lacked that important feature. Uh, but today, uh, the success of our facility through hard work and hard planning, uh, we're going to dedicate today in this uh, accumulated effort uh, a facility that is now dedicated to the health and wellness of the community. And we're proud to provide this facility to the community. This is a proud day for Bellevue. A great day for patients and hopefully a very satisfying day for all of you for, for your part in making this medical center behind us a reality. As a second generation Bellevue physician, it's a day my family and my father and I have been looking forward to for many, many years. Now, Bellevue has a lot to be proud of. It's the first city in Nebraska. It's located in the fastest growing county in the state. And it's home to Offutt Air Force Base in Stratcom. The only thing Bellevue has not had is its own hospital, and that changes today. One of my patients the other day approached me and she was asking me about the hospital. She, she's had a, a hip problem for many years and, and uh, she needs a new hip. And, and she finally got to the point where she said that I, I'm sick and tired of this, I need to have this replaced. So, we said, I, so I said, I will, uh, I will set you up at a nearby hospital and, and get it, we'll get it done right away. And uh, she asked me, you know, isn't that hospital done yet? And, uh, and I, you know, I kind of scratched my head and I said, well, it'll be done in about a month. Um, and she says, Doc, well, you know, I've waited this long, I can wait another month for our hospital to be built. And that's, what, that's the pride that the citizens of Bellevue are feeling. This is their hospital, and they cannot wait for it to be done, and we're proud to present it to them. And we're dedicated to a healthier you. That's our brand promise. That's what we're here for. The words for this theme line are very, were very carefully selected. Our nurses have an average years of service of over 13 years. It may be a brand new facility, but we got a very qualified and experienced staff ready to serve. I do appreciate the support of everybody in the community and their enthusiasm. In the 30 plus years I've been in healthcare administration, I have never seen a community so excited about uh, developing a hospital in their community. They, they are just uh, excited, they want it to happen, they want it to be good, they want to have the best quality medicine and healthcare available to them. They recognize that by doing this, it's going to provide opportunities to attract other business and, uh, and stabilize other things. Um, and uh, everywhere I've gone, I've run into people from Bellevue who have commented how excited and enthusiastic about this new facility they truly are. Uh, I'm really delighted to be here today. This is a great part of our state, and what you're doing today is very, very important. Uh, so Dr. Osterholm, the Nebraska Medical Center, and all the doctors who are involved in this project and the staff, congratulations. This hospital is a partnership that exemplifies how Nebraskans work together. It started, as he said, when local doctors approached the Nebraska Medical Center with the idea of building a hospital for the Bellevue community. These doctors are now part owners in this endeavor and they have designed a facility that meets the needs of patients and doctors. This hospital incorporates advances in technology and patient care into its day-to-day -day operations. With the completion of this project, residents of this area will have access to a modern hospital that will ensure quality health care is available to the residents of Bellevue and Sarpy County. Dedicated and caring individuals are the heart and soul of any quality healthcare operation. 
So I particularly want to thank the entire staff of the Bellevue Medical Center uh, for their commitment to providing quality health care. Uh, that's what this is all about, and we appreciate the job that you're going to do. Uh, and again, today I just want to say congratulations. We're very, very proud of this community. It is truly a pleasure and an honor for me to be here today uh, to see this uh, great facility uh, being uh, opened and uh, opening for the care of the citizens uh, of this area and beyond. I think it's important to say that, that Bellevue and the Sarpy County region and eastern Nebraska is clearly on the move. In addition to this new hospital, we'll also have a hospital uh, with the VA in the near future in, in, the, in Omaha, in this region. And I'm also happy to say that, that we will have a new headquarters for STRATCOM right here at Offutt Air Force Base. And these show that we are on the move not only as a, as a health center re region for health care overall, but we're also seeing this gro the growth in this fastest growing county and this, this wonderful area in eastern Nebraska moving forward as it should. And like the governor, I'm not anxious to have the need of your hospital anytime soon. But it is a matter of comfort to know that if I or others who do need it, that it's here. Thank you. May God continue to bless America and our men and women in uniform. Thank you all.